Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here on the Iron Man Profile. In today's video, we're going to get so close to Max Powder, it is ridiculous, as well as finally get one of the rarest Abbey Phone contacts, at least for me it was, and uh, getting a bunch of Skyblock XP from that. So if you guys are excited for today's video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Super quickly though, if you do find yourself checking out the Hypixel store, whether it be for any of the remaining fire sales, maybe you need some Skyblock gems for some booster cookies, or you're just buying a rank, don't forget to use my career code on checkout as code Zach, just like my name, Z-A-C-H. If you type that in on checkout, you'll actually save 5% on your purchase, and it's an amazing way to support myself and the channel, and I do greatly appreciate everyone using my code on a regular basis. Seriously, you guys are actually amazing, um, but without further ado, let's jump right into today's video. Oh my god. Okay, 15H just told me that Trinity's in this lobby, bro. I've been trying to get Trinity for so long i don't think i don't think you guys understand i am not on dungeon stuff i do not have dungeon stuff and i can't waste a revive i need to like hide like a little <laughs> like i literally need to hide for way too long uh, okay let's just uh stay alive i don't even have my bow out on my crossbar which is great he said here i'm on my way i'm on my way okay hold up where are we at oh is this the trinity room my guess I've literally never seen this room before, so I'm guessing it is. Yo, where, where's Trinity at, though? Wait. See, I would literally come across this room and not even know where she is. Up top? Oh, God. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Make it stop. Okay, good. I, I had my bow somewhat close. Where? Where is she? Brother. I'm, 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 cl I'm scaling. Trinity, I'm coming. Where, <laughs> bro? Yo, 58's got to kill some of these mobs for me, though, no? Where? I don't even know where it is. Wait. <gasps> Trinity. Okay, hold up. Do I go around here? What is this? Oh, it's the the wall. Um, Let me find my dungeon stuff. Grab a little bit of this. There we go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Ooh, regeneration nine potions, huh? You want a secret to my potions? It's quite simple. The brew requires revive stones. That's why they can only be made around here. Give me a couple of those and I'll give you my Abbey phone. Oh, wait. Okay. Wait, open fairy room. Please, no, 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 no. No, he left. He left from dumb dungeon stuff on. <laughs> okay, I need to like hobble my way around this run. And um, basically get uh, three revive stones if I'm not mistaken. But I, I'm not on the reforges for this. I am not. I wasn't planning on doing dungeons just now. 50H like does like solo runs. And he found one that had. Uh, oh, wait. Fairy room right here. Okay, hold up. One, two, three, four. That's one. Give me two. Give me three. Okay, there we go. Do we have three? We should have three. We do. Okay, beautiful. Now we run back. We're on the move. Bro, I've been wanting to get the Trinity contact for so long. I don't think you guys understand. Like, I, I've just never come across this room before. This is literally the first one I've seen. And 50H was just spamming me saying, Zach, wake up, hurry up. And uh, I was just powder grinding. So uh, luckily it worked out. I think it's somewhere up here. Yes, work my way around. Wow. F number one Skyblock player, by the way. Bro's dead. Trinity, how you doing? Uh, oh, you're, you're gonna yap again. I'm honestly, I'm okay with it. For the 10 sky block XP, you can yap all you want. Please yap away. Um, made around here. Yes, give item. There we go. 10 sky block XP. We got Trandy's contact. That is beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Thank goodness. It's done. Okay, perfect. Well, I only have one more Abbey phone contact I need. It's uh, Queen Nyx, which is 12,000 mage rep. So that one won't be for a while, but. One more to go, and then we have Max Abbey phone for the time being until they add uh, new ones. But shout out 15H, bro. Appreciate it. So ever since yesterday's video, not only did I go and get Trinity's contact, but um, I didn't record much last night because I, I was basically just powder mining until like 3 a.m. And then, yeah, I, I powder mined for probably over six hours yesterday. I'm not gonna, at least like an actual minimum uh, guaranteed. So like yesterday when we finished yesterday off, we're at just over 11 million mithril powder and 18.1 million gemstone powder. Since then, your boy's been going a little crazy, I can't lie. Uh, if we go ahead and take a look, I'm now up to 12.1 million mithril powder and 19.3 million gemstone powder. So I went up 1.1 million mithril and I went up 1.2 million gemstone. And as you can see, 
We are so close to being done. I only have seven more XP available from this. Um, and yeah, we need less than 400,000 Mithril Powder, and we need less than 700,000 Gemstone Powder until we are max powder on this profile. So um, kind of insane. That'll be tomorrow's video, I'm going to be honest, because I'm recording this like a few hours before you guys actually see it. I just turned my brain off, and I was like, I want to try and finish powder grinding for tomorrow's video. I came a little short, but uh, we will have it done for tomorrow, so that will be very nice. Uh, I'm literally going to like just keep powder mining when I'm done recording today's video, but in that process, I got a ton of stuff done. Um, first and foremost, I'm actually in the Precursor Remnants powder grind now, but I powder grind in the jungle for a while with um, um, a jungle pickaxe, and I did that because I need a ton of sludge juice. I had like none. Um, as you can see, I have 9,600 here in my sack, but I also crafted and forged up eight uh, gemstone mixtures last night, and then I put my fuel tank in the forge. So right now, if I go warp forge, I actually have my uh, titanium fuel tank, which, yeah, I know it's only titanium, but it is upgrading to the gemstone fuel tank, and I have enough sludge juice to actually go ahead and craft 25 gemstone mixtures for the perfectly cut one. Um, and then I was kind of just powder grinding in the um, Precursor Remnants trying to get to 70 syn uh, synthetic hearts because I think I was a few off. Let me see if I actually have that now, though. Uh, synthetic hearts. Okay, wow, I literally didn't get any from like an hour of power grinding this morning. But So I need three more of these, and then I have all the sludge juice. I need to mine a few gemstones for all the gemstone mixtures. Obviously, 25 times worth of this, so that's going to take a little bit, but... Yeah, and uh, one thing that's kind of crazy is this has 20 hours left. Like, I put this in last night, and um, luckily, the mining fiesta is in 21 and a half hours tomorrow, so I, I kind of got worried when I when I realized that I'd put that in before the mining fiesta, and I was like, oh my goodness, am I going to have 3,000 fuel for the entire mining fiesta? But luckily, we're good. And also, for the mining fiesta tomorrow, I'm not even going to be mining ruby. We're going to be doing something a little bit different, and uh, I'm kind of excited about it. So that is that. Um in terms of our skyblock xp though as you guys probably even saw in the trandy clip we we're at 48 out of 100 now i'm at 59 out of 100 and that's all from powder i haven't done any essence upgrades without you guys but we're currently 141 xp away from level 400 which is kind of insane and i actually have a bunch of essence that we can uh, go ahead and spend so i have 3.1k gold and 2.4k diamond essence that needs uh needs to be kind of relocated i guess into these essence shops so let's start with the gold one since that's the one we're closest to right now if i can get there without running into blocks uh here we are so yeah as i was saying we have 3.1k and uh oh i wish i had 3250 i could do two upgrades but i think i have to do a breaking for this one gives the most skyblock xp i could do these two upgrades i think right that would be 2500 that's kind of tempting too i don't know how much xp those give though treasure of the earth and dwarven training uh how much how much how much skyblock xp is that going to be um, Treasure of the Earth 3 would be 3 XP, and then Dwarven Training would be 2. So that would give me 5 XP. It gives me the same amount, and this one's cheaper. Okay, well, yeah, we're doing a Breaking 4. Uh, also, Vitality's just good for, like, Blaze Slayer and stuff like that, so don't mind if I do. I'll take my 5 Skyblock XP. 3,000 for that last upgrade, but that's going to be worthwhile. But there we go. We're up to 64 out of 100 now. Uh, if we go Warp Crystal Nucleus really quickly, we can come over to Gemma, the Diamond Essence person. I have 2,400, and I think I know which upgrade I'm doing. I think I'm doing Diamond in the Rough 3. Uh, running out of XP, we can actually get from Diamond Essence, but I still need a ton of Diamond Essence. So it's a weird spot to be in, but... Yeah, increases tank class experience, gain by now 6%, and that was three skyblock XP. Don't mind if we do, but yeah, I've been waiting to do those for a while, and uh, finally did. And then in terms of our hardstone minion, we're only at 6,900. Bro, this is so slow. I wish I started powder grinding with a snail pet way back. I'm literally only a third of the way to a tier 12 hardstone minion, and... I'm almost done with powder, so I don't know what I'm going to do. Like, am I just going to sit here and, like, mine hardstone after the fact? So, kind of brutal. I think I kind of threw by the amount of Silexes I crafted before actually going for the minion. I think the minion would have been would have been much more worthwhile. And the fact that I crafted a Silex by accident is probably the worst part. I mean, that is a third of the grind or a fourth or something. Just wasted. So, kind of brutal. But it is what it is. And uh, there's also something else I did uh, in between us last talking. So something I finished up yesterday that um, I didn't rec I wasn't able to record it when I finished it, but I wanted to grab it just in case it affected the position number. But I finished all my contributions for the community center refurbishment. Bro, we have so many updates on the way. Like I'm actually so hyped. Like 
this alone, I'm excited for. I can't lie. New mare perks, bro. We haven't had new mare perks since they added mares. You know what I mean? So, like, this... And that's all we know about. We haven't even seen anything, but I'm just, like, hyped. Also, the builds look pretty cool. Like, I'm assuming this is the new community center. I have no idea what building this is going to be. This looks kind of insane, too. Like, an events uh, kind of tent or something like that. Either way, should be, like, good fun. But I did finish all my contributions, as you can see. I'll probably just keep contributing just to help the update get there faster. I think at 400,000 contributions, it should get released. Maybe I know they want to put it on alpha first, but uh, we'll see if... Or when that happens but i did finish all 20 and i claimed the locked ballot box so uh unfortunately i'm only edition 542 i'm not gonna lie i kind of trolled with my contributions though because um i was like one of the first people to do the first set of contributions like i insta noticed it and um like i did it before like discords announced that there was a community center like that type of stuff so i was very early on like 2 p.m uh est on like the day that this got added and every day i kind of just kept on bumping back my contributions by like an hour and a half because i would genuinely just sit there and forget that i had to do them that day so i ended up claiming this at like 9 30 p.m last night is when my contribution timer reset so i'm only 5 42 but it's better than some of my other contributions that i've done uh for some of the other mementos i can't lie um like for example which one i guess my golden collar wasn't bad but yeah like my wizard portal 3688 so that is that is a little rough um i guess that's really the only other one right this was the the winter event so it was 215 260 3688 is kind of insane and then 542 so not terrible but i, I love these little memento things i really hope they keep doing it because uh I don't know, it would just be really cool to fill my whole personal vault with, like, memento special items. So that's kind of uh, the goal, but pretty happy with that. And then my cake slice of the century on the winning team, and I got exactly 400 tickets, and that wasn't even planned. Like, it is a clean number. I was on the winning team, so yeah, I, this is a really cool one, too. I love these little, like, specialty items just for, like, being there. I enjoy those, so... Yeah, pretty exciting stuff. We don't know what this update's going to have in store, but I did my contributions. You guys should too, okay? The faster we get the updates, the better. Also, something I was trying to avoid showing is um, so someone passed my level on Iron Man, bro. I'm 45th again. I was 44. I was chilling. I didn't think anyone was close to me, and it wasn't even the dude who was, like, 45th who passed me. It was someone down from, like, 52nd. He got Blaze Blaze 8. Um, let, me, let me go ahead and show you. So, not only did he pass me, currently I'm at, like, what? uh 60 67 xp towards level 399 this dude named trox bro i was talking to him yesterday he just skyrocketed past me i can't even lie he's 42 xp into level 399 this dude was saving i swear he was like saving xp to try and launch to 400 ahead of me he hit blaze slayer level 8 he went up a forging level he went up a catacombs level and i think he did some museum stuff or something like that and he just like launched past me now he's 42 out of 100 towards level 400 so ggs to him i don't think i'll be able to pass him i'm gonna be honest i'm like nearly a full level behind like 80 xp or something so fair play bro bro was saving up some stuff i wish i i wish i had like a level worth of stuff saved up because then i'd be at almost level 400 but hey we're getting here i want to get level 400 honestly before i don't know when any of the updates are coming but i don't want to hit level 400 from like a big update you know what i mean like my main goal is to try and hit 400 before all these updates hit the server just because i feel like it'll be more of like an achievement you know like it'll be like more of a i grinded to get level 400 instead of like for example the glassite tunnels if those come out bro there's 20 skyblock levels worth of xp up for grabs in that update like i would hit level 400 the day that came out uh just from hitting like hard of the mountain eight or um you know like maxing some collections working towards some of the new stuff there's so much xp in that update so my goal is to try and hit it before then i have some plans obviously i'm going to be finishing powder running which is seven more skyblock xp i would love it if i could do another essence upgrade um i don't know how realistic that is i i, I think a, a gold one's actually very real, realistic like another hundred uh gold or i guess if i'm doing the three thousand one we'll see how much essence i have when i'm max powder but i do have something else that's going to give a ton of skyblock xp in uh the next day or so and that is this right here i still have 73 skyblock xp available from uh mining fiesta tasks so i won't actually be mining ruby for this i have a plan and i kind of balanced it out i was like 200 mil i really need 200 mil i can't lie but at the same time level 400 is the big overarching goal if i have to mine some gemstones without a fiesta that's okay hopefully i max this before the end of the fiesta and i can still like maybe mine gemstones for an hour we'll have to wait and see tomorrow morning but 
um, yeah, that's uh, that's my overarching goal. Level 400 at all costs, okay? I'll do whatever it takes. I'll spend the whole bank. Like, I've, I only have 200 mil to my name, and I, I'm probably going to spend this on something in the next couple days, so... It's gotta be done though. One thing that is so nice about having like powder almost max now is like all my perks. Like I have two more upgrades on titanium and sanium and I will be able to max those with max powder. So that's gonna be super nice. Like every single mithril thing. And then I'll have to see how much of this I'll be able to max with um, max gemstone. I think a good amount though. Like a good amount of almost everything should be completely max. But being able to just like not pay attention to like balancing like i remember back in the day i have to be like okay i'll keep these on 40 so i can have like a little bit of like this or something and then like trying to calculate okay i need to like this the cost of professional needs to be an eighth of mining speed to make it worth it like all these weird little things because i didn't have max powder and now like as we're getting close to it just being able to like spam max every single perk is uh gonna be so so nice so really happy about that and um obviously i'm gonna do my best to have powder maxed out for tomorrow's video before the mine fiesta but hopefully you guys did enjoy today's video unfortunately that's all the time i have i literally just sat there and powder grind for hours and hours last night i mean i went up over a million powder of each if you guys have ever done that especially now with the essence drops it's a lot more difficult than it was right when they added the insta opening chest so it's a work in progress but my goodness we will get to level 400 one way or another and this is a massive thing to have checked off our list so thank you so much for watching today's video all the way to the end if you guys did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe use code zach when checking on the high pixel store for any ongoing fire sales some ranks or anything else in between and without further ado i can't wait to see you guys in the next one take care and peace out